Christine, it's a... Epcot day. Woo. Good morning besties. Today is an Epcot day. We are going right now. Well, in a minute after I've just shown you a few things. It is half past seven. Scott has got a boarding uh, for what time? Uh, what group? Exactly. 21? 23 Was it? I think. So quite close to be Brilliant. honest. Yeah. So I thought I'd just give you a little outfit check because I know some of you like them. It's really nice that you comment and let me know. So outfit check of the day. Just got this little dress on and Mickey Mouse. I've gone from sketches to these. I have brought my sketches but these are Mickey Mouse on you know. We're in Disney. We might as well. Then I have these Mickey Mouse earrings. So cute. And then this is what Scott got me on my last trip. How nice is that? I've got my Apple Watch. Um, this ring, which Scott also got me on my last trip. And then my magic band. I've actually missed wearing magic bands. I'm so happy that I have got them. And then Scott today is all done for Epcot. Ooh. I'm ready to ride Guardians. Guardians of the Galaxy. Wow. Yeah. Was this the one that Alex had? No, she never had that no. one. It was a black one, weren't it? Yeah. You were very jealous, weren't you? I got this from Primark, but she said she also got hers yeah. from Primark, but I've never seen yeah. her one from And Primark. we still haven't ever seen her one, have we not? No. I do like this one, though. Yeah, that one's definitely... very like... Uh, definitely you, this one. It's very uh, Guardians yeah. coaster theming yeah, type. Yeah, it is. So, yeah, we've had a good sleep. We are ready for the day. We're going to get something to drink, aren't we? We're going to get a coffee. Uh, yeah, I might even get a snacky to be honest. And Scott's just finished actually doing the window, so I'll show you that in a minute. But let's head out, make sure that we've got everything. I still don't believe we're here. I'm just, I don't know. It's going to take me all week, and then I'm going to get used to being here, and then we're going to go home. <laughs> so I don't know. You're going to enjoy it while it lasts. Yeah, definitely. I'm all for enjoying the moment, so. Let's get ready to have the most magical day. It is a festival of the arts. So that is such a really fun festival, by the way. It is the shortest, but it is really, really fun. I absolutely love it. Oh my God, we've just opened the door and we've just had a lizard. Where's it gone, Scott? Well, I don't know. Oh my God, where's it gone? Genuinely, we've just had a lizard come in the room. It was only a tiny little thing. Uh-oh. And we under that cupboard there. Uh-oh. There's that way they probably get in all the time. I know, but we don't want a lizard in the room. It was literally that we, tiny. Our suitcases are under there. It's gonna like hop in and come home with us. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Scott reckons that there's gonna be like it's gonna be able to get out, so Yeah. But I he said he said there's gonna be holes in the wall which There will be, there'll be gaps everywhere. Yeah, but yeah, if that was the case then all the lizard would come in. No, not necessarily. <laughs> Look, it can get out of that. Event if they wanted to mm. we'll get in from that event. We've just like left it in the room at the minute, but hopefully like the mousekeeper comes in and a bit or something. We'll we'll have a look, but hopefully it's I'm scared. This is our room though. We've just put this up. So cute. Disney Springs, Monorail, Epcot. It's so cool. And then we're gonna put like these lights on tonight. So yeah, that's our room. Mm. So it's med for a cloudy day today with highs of 24. But right now it is the slightest bit chilly right now. I love that, how you come out of the door and then you can play the beanbags. Mia's got like playing them. I love this bit. And I actually love where we are as well. I think it's really, really nice. I'm also wearing this this morning. Oh, there's so many wildlife. We can just see a squirrel. And I got this last trip. I have a black version of this, but I just love them. They're just like dead velvety and nice mm. and soft. You're not wearing a jacket, are you, this I'm morning? I'm not wearing a jacket, no, because I know that it'll just go in my bag more than you. Oh. I so cute. Foraging. It's not even foraging. It's throwing the nut down in gullet. <laughs> so we're just in the food court area. We're going to get some light, probably to share, because we're going to that pot today, so I'm just going to eat food. Good. That looks so good, but I don't feel like I can stomach it this morning. Should we not just get the chocolate croissant? And that and that is virtually the same size, the same price almost, and you get a lot more of that. Scott is, that's basically Scott's way of saying, yeah. I just want the cinnamon roll. That's, no, that's good math. Go get it then. Breakfast. <gasps> Look, Scott again judging me because we've got a coffee. 
and I'm drinking it through a straw. Here's a bit of a sin. <laughs> it's warm coffee though, it's not like it's piping hot. I just piping love that. Hot that. So yeah, we're gonna share this this morning because we're gonna have a lot to eat at Epcot. Mm. What's that like? It's nice? It's a bit stalish, but it's nice. Oh. How much was that? That was... Four summer. Four seventy-nine. Four seventy-nine. Catching, catching you out right now. Hello. So we're sharing this, right? What has he gone and done? Hmm? He's at the centre of the roll, the best bit. And let me this. You're actually wrong, Scott. No. <laughs> yeah, you are. Now is the best time. Oh. <laughs> so just then I just said to him, send me the picture of the quote that was on the Magic Kingdom bus yesterday. Just revert it. Can you not revert it to the no. original? <laughs> and he took a picture and it had no writing on whatsoever. <laughs> so luckily he's done it changing. on live. What does it actually say? Uh, Show them. Hang on, I've gone off it now, so I don't. Now is the best time of our lives. Now is the best time of our lives. How cute is that? That's like my new quote. That is so adult. I just love that. That is the best quote ever. Now is the best time of our lives, Scott. <laughs> yeah, now is eating centre of the roll. No, that, that's that's not the best time of our life. That is just. <laughs> I'm gonna put that in my Instagram caption. Now is the best time of our lives. You've heard it here first because that is just so true in so many ways. And I'm a sucker for little quotes and cute things like that. So and it's a reminder that now is precious. <laughs> as I like to call it. So we are gonna actually board Guardians in like literally 10 minutes. 10 probably. minutes, yeah. So, which is perfect because I hate having food before Guardians because it just rumbles my stomach. So that's really good, I can't wait for that. I wonder what song we're gonna get. I hope we get Disco Inferno. I hope we get everybody. But Disco Inferno, to be fair, actually like, it's a good song. It's a good way to perp you up. Yeah, it? yeah. So. Honestly, I just want to have a quick message to the besties that we've just seen because that was just so lovely, wasn't it? Yes. We saw some besties yesterday at the airport who said hi, which was really lovely as well. And then we've just been at our resort just talking to them. We and were they... waiting for the bus. Yeah. We were very busy, so we waited like three or four buses. Uh, yeah. lo a lovely family come up. Uh, yeah. Shout out to Marlon and Amy. Yeah. And the, girls. And the children, yeah. Evie and Olivia. Olivia. Yeah. yeah. Honestly, thank you so much. You make our day. Anybody that comes up, it is not like anything. Like, don't think that you're like, I don't know, annoying us or whatever. I no. literally love it because I get to say she thank lived, you. She lives for that stuff. Yeah, I get to say, say thank you in person. <laughs> Monorail again. Oh my gosh, one second. <laughs> We love a good monorail but no honestly thank you so much from the bottom of my heart i just love having a conversation i just love saying thank you in person as well because i it's like a special thank you because obviously you're a bestie and you're you're spending all of your time watching me also they're on the honeymoon yeah so have a good rest of your holiday yeah. and enjoy yeah. the rest of your honeymoon yeah so we're gonna now enjoy the day have a magical day take everything in as per usual it isn't like I mean, I can still feel some heat, kind of, but it's like the perfect weather, isn't it? Yeah, but it's gonna get warmer. Like, it's only like, is it like 18 degrees now? I, I think feel it's like get to 24. We've, we've got a good week anyway. So, yeah, it looks very busy at the minute coming in. But well, we're just gonna, just gonna chill. Mainly, we've come for the festival today, so food, food, food. Um, Guardians, Guardians. <laughs> one Guardians. I don't know if Frozen's <laughs> down as well. But yeah, we're just gonna have a magical day. So give this video a thumbs up and let's let's go. Let's what, what's that? Let's do this. That's um, 
but that's cinema, isn't it? Let's do yeah. this. <laughs> Scott's gone to wash out the cup, so I just thought I'd show you this. We did this last year. We've done the, the B one when it's the festival of uh, Flower and Garden Festival, sorry. And then we did this one last year. It's kind of similar this year as well. Oh, sorry, I just found something. Ooh, that's well cute. Oh, that is very cute. I love that. I am wanting some ears. I'm wanting a uh, lounge fly. I'm also wanting to get some of the pins. I want the Festival of the Arts pin and stuff like that. So yeah, let's, let's just see what we can we can do. All right, so we've just been called for Guardians. Stop the video now. Put in the comments what music you think I'd like to get. we're gonna get. I'm hoping for Disco Inferno. I'm happy with Everybody wants to rule the world, or yeah, Disco Inferno. Is Disco Inferno the band? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I feel like that one's probably the perfect one. So, yeah, let's see. Let's see. just got off that ride. Um, technical difficulties, thanks to Scott. Uh, You're getting on the blame for this. The SD card wasn't working in his GoPro, so he wasn't able to film it. No I doubt we got, will I be getting it. A minute long. Yeah, no doubt we will go back on it though. So, what did we get, Scott? I ran. Yeah, and do you know what? Which that was never had. No, we never had it before, and that wasn't too bad. Honestly, I don't want to see that picture that I um, I got took of us because I was not expecting it when we was. When it was like turning, I just was not expecting the turn at all. But honestly, oh, what a good ride. Such, such a fun ride. But love that we got a different song that we've never had before. We have took some pictures and stuff. I made Scott go to the Guardians bit because obviously he needs a little picture there on his own. Give him the spotlight for that because that is such a cool t-shirt. For a minute. It's yeah. exactly about an hour's cue. Before you claim it back. I don't claim it, Scott. <laughs> I can't help being It's all right. Being me. You like no. being the main character, don't you? Main character vibes all day. <laughs> no, but what we're going to do is obviously get some food now because we have just got the most intense ride out of the day. Off. Hey, it's I five, said it's on five to ten. So the oh, is food it? is open in five minutes. Okay. Yeah. I did say on this trip that I was going to go for every single ride, which I will, except from Mission Space. That's just a no-no. It's a no-no. I love mission space. Mm -mm, nah. -uh. It looks like there's a few schools. Yeah, it does. The wait times are okay. I would say it's a slight bit busier this morning, um, but not too bad. So we're gonna make our way around the booths. I'm thinking maybe start at Canada first. You wanna start at Canada? Only because I think margarita or whatever it is. Makes start. It I feel like I've got nothing in my stomach right, right. now, and okay. we both. No, we're all no besties that I'm I'm a lightweight so Oh yeah. Better not just better start not. on an empty stomach. Nope, better not. We do have a list that we want to try. With it being five minutes to ten, the booths aren't open yet because they open yep. at ten AM. They're prepping. Yeah, they're basically prepping, yeah, true. Uh, that smells good. I think we're gonna do the book where you have to have six items on the book. Five. To, is it five? There's six to choose from, but it's funny. You need to get five. Oh, right, really? Yeah. Right there. Five right. stamps. Okay, fair enough. And then you get a complete a cookie, and then you get like a slushy type drink, don't no. you? Which is different this year, because they normally just give you the cookie. Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't say oh, That smells good, Scott. That smells so good, doesn't that, it? Do you reckon that's that? I'm not is sure. It must be because there's nowhere else near. It's got to be that one. Oh, do you remember which one was it where they had the corn? Corn, that was down oh, there. that wasn't that wasn't in January though, was it? That was uh, that flower, was flower and garden. garden. Yeah. Oh, I just love these booths so much. There's so oh, so much good things to choose from. But we're Is gonna it... try. We're probably gonna do this in two parts with the food. I think. Yeah. Yeah, well, definitely. We're about to walk up to something what's new this year. All right. Um, and that's the movie picture spots. From different movies. Oh right, so you, you meant like food. You, no, like you go into the movies. So these is what I was talking about. So there's you take a picture. That one's Cinderella. A Sleeping Beauty, I can't remember which. Mary Poppins with the penguins right there. 
and then that one over there is you know, the main character getting back in again. <laughs> and then that one over there, I don't know if you can quite make it out, but that's um, Wish. It's got a little goat there and stuff. What's your favourite one? I think my favourite one is the Mary Poppins one, with the penguins. Yeah, the, the penguins is good, yeah. Is that, is that, is that one Sleeping Beauty or Cinderella? Sleeping Beauty. Ah, Sleeping Beauty. I said, I, I said it's, I can't remember if it's Sleeping Beauty or Cinderella, but I did say them both, so there you go. Oh, and the choke art. Ooh. Yeah, they've started some. Oh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. So these, if you haven't been before, they basically people draw these out on the floor with chalk. There's quite a lot of them. That is amazing, isn't it? That's so like all the detail that they have. Is yeah. Wow. I don't have any more to do here. You got any mouse work? That's done in the style of that painting. Yeah. That's part of that famous painting. Oh, that's got a bit of wet on. Yeah, that's the only bad thing if it rains. All the hard work's gone. Just like that one, though. This one's rubbing out. Surf's up. Oh, wow. Look at this one. I ain't never seen them do... Wow, that's cool. Epcot is one of probably my favourite park. I think it's a very big tie between Magic Kingdom and Epcot. But Epcot, since you're getting older, you know, it, I just love it. It's good for like food, drink, just to have a chilled out day. There is rides, obviously, but I just love it, especially now that there's Guardians there now. But just listening to the music and the sounds that they have. Oh, that, that sun's got. That nice. sun's nice. The clouds are going away, the sun is coming out. Oh. Shaping up to be a beautiful day. Being a bit cheesy, but me, me and Scott, we look, we don't like, we're not very touchy feely, especially outside. But can I just say, well, not in public, we're not. But can I just say, like, I'd rather, I, there's nobody in the world I'd rather be here oh, with than you. Of course, back at you. <laughs> no, but like honestly, like once you find that person, like, it's just, just oh. nobody. Alright. Yeah. I'm done being cheesy. <laughs> I'm just being cheesy. It just, it just Disney. It just makes me so emotional and so like grateful. It's just cheesy. And then we're gonna go get some cheese. <laughs> okay, so update. We thought we was five or ten minutes away from eating food. We're not. We're another forty-five minutes. It's eleven. We open at eleven. Why did we always think that it opened at ten? I always thought all the booths open at ten a.m. Is that in the spring, summer? Maybe flower summer? and garden. Yeah, possibly. Yeah. Maybe. But yeah, so we've got 45 minutes of walking around and stuff to do before we get booed. So we've got to have a reshuffle. Yeah. A rethink. Yeah. I'm just happy looking out to this. It's like a nice yeah. breeze. Yeah, there's birds around. <laughs> yeah, you're taking in more of me now, Scott. <laughs> yeah. So what do you want to do? Where do you want to go? Just The world chill. is our palm tree. Yeah, as Tim Tracker says. As Tim Tracker says. Um, yeah. Let's have a look maybe in some shops and stuff. Yeah. yeah. While we are here, I mean, the zoom on this camera isn't brilliant, but look at how clear. We haven't we haven't been back since the barges have been gone out of the no. central lagoon. No, oh no, we haven't actually. So no. look at how clear that is now, and how much better it is. Not having that massive ISO. I mean, you can actually see that is is that Italy? Yeah, Italy. Italy in the dish. You can see everything. You can see the American pavilion. You can see everything without those big, ugly, horrible barges in the way. So that was a good decision. I mean, decision. they did serve the purpose, I'd well, say. Well, it was good for a fireworks show, but yeah. it was just 
I wish that they could just take them away and put yeah, them but back. It, yeah, but it would have been too much work for them, yeah. wouldn't it, to do every day. But yeah, just wanted to say because that's much clearer, much more beautiful. It's nice. So we have just gone to Canada. We were like watched the show, which was really, really lovely. It was like a 15 minute show, was it? 10 minute show? Yeah, about that, yeah. We've not watched it in a very long time. Um, so we're now gonna make our way down to Test Track to eat at our first booth. The time is five to 11. So I'm hungry, Scott's hungry. We're ready for the festival today. So Scott's waiting in queue. We're going to Cuisine Classique and we're gonna get the beef Wellington. We're just like having a look at the drinks that you can get over here. And I don't think we're gonna get a drink from here. Right there. Definitely need a drink. I might end up going into Club Cool and just having a few of the like pops for the time being. But I definitely want to get the margarita today as well. All right, so Scott's just come with the beef Wellington. It was eight seventy-five dollars. Uh -huh. Yeah. You just said our portion size was smaller yeah, than the others. Yeah, I was a bit disappointed when they <laughs> handed it to me, but. Let's have a look. It doesn't look too bad. We are sharing, so it does look really good though, doesn't it? Yeah, but we need to find somewhere to, to, to eat it. To eat. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully the music's not too loud and you can hear us because we're sat down right next to a speaker. But let's see, it is a bit windy as well. What do you think? Mash is all right. Like garlicky mash. Oh, is it? Mm. I'm just gonna turn this over on its side so I can. Uh, this is half. Half of this is basically gonna be one bite. Yeah, that's okay. We are sharing. So I'm basically gonna put my half. You're getting some of the um. The sauce. Your thoughts? It's all right. That's. I'm still. Disappointed with the size of it for 875, but it's okay. Does it's it taste a little bit dry? But really? Okay. okay. Okay, your turn. What did you just get a bite out of then? The mash. Oh, the mash, yeah. Mm. The mash was quite nice. I don't mind this sauce either. Yeah, the gravy. I get what you mean by it looks a bit, it's a bit dry. Nice, though. Yeah, it's nice, yeah. I just I'm, wish there was more of it. You just need a lot of sauce on the beef wellington and then it doesn't like, dry it out. So our next booth is deconstructed dish. We're gonna get, um, well Scott's gonna get the BLT. I don't think I'm gonna have that. Um, we're gonna have a key lime pie and then there's the deconstructed strawberry mint julep that we're gonna try as well. Also, there's a little sign here and that's how you know it's one of the snack things for to get a stamp. So then you can get your completer cookie at the end which is really cool. And obviously these are the Disney dining plan um, signs. So these are the ones that are on the Disney dining plan. All right, so this is the deconstructed BLT. Then we've also got the key lime pie, which is deconstructed, which looks really good. And then we've got this, which is deconstructed strawberry mint julep. That looks really good. So I've just made a little, I've basically constructed my deconstructed <laughs> BLT. So let's see. You like it? I actually, I like that more than I thought I was going to like. Oh, that's good. You need to try some like that. I don't think I'm gonna like that. Mm. I think I'll just have a little bit of that. I've just had some of that. It's good. That is better than what I thought it was gonna be. Even Scott Pop said the exact same. I don't mind the avocado crema as well. Wow. That's, re that's really good. What's your rating for that? I need a 10. Really? Yeah. I'm going to call it a, a 9.5. The okay. Beef Wellington, we both agreed a, just Scott just agreed that he wanted like a bigger cut of it, but that was really nice. That's really good. Let's try the key lime pie. I think that one is going to be my biggest shock yeah. of the day. Okay, enough of the pork business. Time to move on. It smells minty. Strawberry mint julep. Right, so you just put See? these here. I'm gonna like squeeze it in. Yeah. Because we're gonna probably. It's 
is quite a fun little it thing to like do. Strawberry syrup, isn't it? Yeah. Shall I try it on its own? Mm. Ooh. Oh my god. That's like a strawberry puree. Yeah. And then we've got a metal straw. I'm just gonna. Which is our own straw. Here we have it. What's the thoughts? Ooh. That's really nice. Yeah. It's not strongly minty. No. It's quite. People have subtle. said that. People yeah. have said that. It's like, it's not strongly strawberry either. Oh. I don't know what it is, but it's just really refreshing. Like on a really hot day, you'd just want this. It's really nice. Yeah, I've got you try it. I like the size of the little um, cup as well. It is really refreshing. I want to have a Oh my God, careful you don't spill it on yourself, Scott. Oh yeah. That's therapeutic. <laughs> Now I get more mint than strawberry. Do you? No, I didn't. I think it's really subtle. Yeah. Nice though, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice, yeah. But I get more mint in that than st I do strawberry. Right, now on the key lime pie, Scott's reconstructing. I'm it doing is, it again. That's a funny thing, Matt. What is this? This is the flexible key lime curd. Ooh. So I'll get some of that. I'm not going to have the raspberries. No. That's for you, that. Feels like a key lime pie. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Is it yeah. sweet? Oh, it's sweet, yeah. I think you'll like this, yeah. yeah. Alright, Kiss, your turn. Okay. Yeah. This is a funny texture. Yeah. Alright, get some of that, get some of that, a little bit of that. Let me just get a look at what you're doing. Just like getting everything. Oh, wow. Hang on. Okay, cool. <laughs> Thoughts? You don't look convinced. It's like a key lime pie. Yeah. I like it. Yeah? It's sweet, mm -hmm. but it's just right. Yeah. Yeah. I like this. What's this? this? Whatever this is. Oh, the, 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 the key lime pie. The key lime, sorry. In, in air quotes, though. Yeah. Because it's, it's mousse. It's lime flavoured mousse, I would which, have is, liked, which is made to look like a lime. I would have liked this to be a bit more like crum crumbly. Yeah, I think people have said that as well. I think, yeah. yeah. But honestly, it's really nice. I wish there was more of this sauce though. Yeah. But yeah, really good. Highly recommend. We are now going near this little bit with all the art. I'm obsessed already. Someone's actually painting the canvas though. Yeah. Someone's painting that. Oh yeah, they are. They've, they've, they've started it. And they've started painting bits. Oh my gosh, I can see Dopey. Look at that one. I love that one, but look at the Dopey. And I love the Paris one. Oh, they're beautiful pictures, aren't they? Well, oh my gosh. Oh, I love them. I've always said I always want these, but they're like... They're, they're like, expensive, yeah. it'll be hard to ship home. And I think if I'm right in saying that the like is it some I'm reading us hearing some of like nine months wait for it. Like you, you pay for them and then you're like obviously they make they have to make it. Oh that is that is oh my god, I actually love that. There's a seven dwarf one over there. I know that and the seven dwarf one, but I love that one. I don't think I've ever seen that one. No. Wow, it's so beautiful. Look at all that. Wow, oh my gosh. Oh, that is beautiful. Wow, that, oh my gosh. All these artwork. Somebody's actually painting right now. Seven Dwarfs as well. Behind you can actually just see the tables as well. Oh, yeah. I love Festival of the Arts. Ooh, some jewellery. Wow. Oh, Scott, the Lady in the Trump one. Look at Daisy! Alright, so after admiring the artwork, we're going to go into the creation shop and just have a little bit of a look around, see what new merch there is. Already I can see to the right 
some of my favorite. Like I've been obsessing over this bag. I don't think I'm gonna get this one, but it's such like a shiny, like really nice bag. I feel like my other one's a bit too similar to it though. I love this one as well. Very, it's reminds me of like some of this one. They also have matching ears. Look at all the nice little pretty ears. Oh, and they're really nice. But these are the new Cinderella ears that they've just recently come out. I really want to find the Grogu ears. I would have thought that they would have been in here somewhere. They'll be next list. They'll be over there. Scar! Oh, that is adorable! It's that little uh, the birdie. Oh, and they're pretty ears as well. I like these ones. I really like these ones. So How much are they? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get my phone. Let me take a picture of you. Oh, yeah, they are. Here are the ears. I absolutely love these ones. Do you reckon they're going to be in Hollywood Studio? In fact, I feel like I'm just going to get them now, Scott. Yeah, they're really cute. I love these ones. Obsessed with that. Look at that. Walt Disney World t shirt with Daisy on it. Obsessed. So I've just seen these, which are quite close to the, the same ones as the ears that I, um, I don't think I've shown you the ears, I saw them before anyway. Um, if I find the ears again, I'll show you, but these are really cute. Now I'm going to decide whether I want this lounge fly bag or the boardwalk um, beach club one. I'm going to have a look at the beach club one and decide, but this one, I'm pretty obsessed because it's just all like Disney World, it's got the castle on and stuff, it's got Daisy on especially. I'm gonna have to decide. Got the Festival of the Arts mug. This is really good. I actually really like this one. The little painting of Figment on. Then we've got these Munchlins. Everybody says they smell really nice. Oh. oh my God, they do. They smell like, oh, they smell sweet like a grapey pie, don't they? They smell like the grape thing. They do, like the grape soda thing that they have here. That was actually meant to smell like figs, but it does smell like grape, doesn't it? A little bit. It has a really sweet smell. I am obsessed with this. I just love it so much. And look at that. One of the Starbucks mugs. Oh, I love that. Also, when I'm showing things, I'm very sorry. I should be showing you the price. That was $44.99 for this. How much are they? Are they like, they're, I'm gonna guess like the, are they like $40 and maybe $50? $60. $60. All right, these ears, $45, full of Epcot. I love it. Uh, you know why that is? Why? Ah, lounge fly. Ah. And then I've just spotted these ones here. I've not seen these ones these either. Are these are $35 from Pigman. Also, just spotted this, which is amazing. We've actually not gone to the statue yet. It's, it's over there. Yeah, we've not visited it yet. We, we definitely will though, but how incredible. Oh, I love that. Oh, and the Starbucks series mug of Epcot. Now I'm debating whether to get this one because that's one of my favorites. Also, they have a little Christmas ornament of it. It is $26.99. We can't find the box for the Walt statue. These ones are $24.99. We definitely need to go to that statue, don't we? Scott's like just trying to find the price. So we were just walking past Test Track, which was 75 minutes. So 70. I'm 70 so I was just yeah. really curious of how much wait times of all the other stuff is. What's 10 minutes? Three caballeros. All right, okay. 75 for Frozen, 75 for Ratatouille, 24 Figment, ah, Figment. Yeah. Soaring 90. Oh my gosh. Oh, Soaring 90. over California it is. Oh, we've not watched that. No. Oh, we're gonna have to watch that. 15 for Living with the Land. Is that Nemo? Yeah, Nemo. So we're making our way into World Showcase now and we're starting off at Mexico. We're gonna go to the Mexico Pavilion and try some foods. I think we're probably just gonna get a drink from here, but we'll see. All right, so we are coming to this one. We're just gonna get the smoky banana bliss margarita, the beef. The beef looks a bit too tender for us, doesn't it? Oh. <laughs> the beef looks a bit too tender for us. Yeah. Yeah, so we're just gonna skip on the beef for this one. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's like a, is it like a banana leaf thing? Yeah. Off the banana tree thing, yeah. I think. 
What do you think? Really nice. Yeah? Sweet. Not is very it, banana. Is it right? strong? Because it's a pre-mixed margarita. It's strong, but not strong, strong. Not right. like maybe the one that we normally like. We normally right. like one, and it's um, the last one that we had. Uh -huh. And it was the... Marshmallow. The marshmallow was my favourite. Yeah. I wish they did that this year. It tastes year. like Pirates of the Caribbean. That was my analogy. Really good. Not very strong, actually. But it's no. pre-mixed. Yeah. So it's in, it's, it. a, it's in a container it's and they just put and they just pour it in. It's not poured oh. in front of you. It's not very banana -y. Right. Unless it needs stirring. Okay. Yeah. It's, it's not got very... a hint of smokiness. Yeah, that's what I meant. When you said strong, I meant like a hint of smokiness. It's, it's not, not like strong. It's strong. not strong, no. It's and not banana either. Banana it's nice though, isn't it? It's a hint smoky. Yeah, it is nice, yeah. So the margarita was $15.50 and you could literally just come to Chosa de Margarita. It's got to just try and see the yeah. prices. So basically if you spend another if you spend, spend another two dollars and go there, you can get a um, properly made margarita. Yeah, really, really which fresh. Is probably more value for money. Yeah, but we're glad that we tried it. Yeah. I think it's really nice. I feel like it should be a bit more banana-y. Yeah. Just a little bit, but it's nice though, isn't it? Yeah. I'm glad we tried it. The, uh, a beautiful song, Cerramos con algo de la cuna del mariachi Jalisco, Mexico. A song that's from the Christmas of mariachi and, and it's a type, type of song in rhythm that's really the heart of mariachi music. A song in the voices of Luis and Alejandro, El Son de la Madrugada. Now heading out of Mexico and just going slowly around, we just watched the mariachi band which was we just mixed like well, we got all the of it, yeah. We got the final song. The final song, and they, they just said that they've been performing at Epcot for 42 years since the day it opened. Okay. That is that is crazy. I absolutely love that. If you ever get a chance, definitely stop and watch those shows because their voices and they've just got pure talent. Today is a very pretty busy day. I mean, the rides are up at 70 minutes. It is very busy, but we're just gonna do what we can. Like we said, we're gonna just like chill, aren't we? Mm. Scott it's just said as well, <laughs> when I um, when the mariachi band was on, he was like, close your eyes and drink your margarita and pretend you're in Mexico. <laughs> I love Did it that. Work? Yeah, a little bit. It was really lovely. All right, this is the painted panda, and we're gonna get the shark to pour the bun. Is there any silver the hard lemonade? Ooh, lavender coconut syrup, Scott. It's got, that's an alcoholic one. I know, or butterfly blue, butterfly pea flower infused cocktail with vodka, light rum. I've already scored for that next drink, you know, finish the margarita. I just think like the China Pavilion's quite good for alcohol, so maybe we can try some. But we're going to go and get the shark to pork bun for this one. Okay, so that's China, such a pretty drink. China Pavilion, painted panda. Mm. We've so, still got, <laughs> we've still got bits of banana, but that's how you do it at Epcot. You just drink after drink, food after food. Look at the drink though, and it's so pretty. I feel like I need to take a picture, Scott, of it like closer up because it <laughs> deserves more magic. Yeah. Right, so before you get into the tasting business, let's go over the cost. Yeah. So, that is the Silk River Hard Lemonade, which is 13 50 Char Siu pork bun. What's the sauce? I think it's like a tangy orange sort of citrusy thing. Okay. Like a dip. Uh, that was eight fifty. Okay, Crystal just done some uh, photogenic Instagrammery. She now wants to try the food first, so that's what she's gonna do. Okay, let's see. Mmm. Mmm. So there's a look at it from the inside. The sauce. The sauce, yeah. It makes it sweet and nice. Oh right. Mmm. Okay. Right, so what do you do when you've had a bite of Char Siu pork bun? You wash it down with some pink hard lemonade. Oh, oh, oh. Can't really get the oh. lavender. Oh, okay. But that tastes like Malibu. Oh, does it? Mm. That's interesting because it's vodka, not rum. Not have coconut in it. Oh, it does have coconut in it. Yeah, mm. sorry, you're tastes right. Tastes like Malibu. Yeah, you, it has got coconut in it. That's right. I wish I could have more of the lavender, but I can't. But that. Oh. Is really nice. Oh, she likes that. You like Malibu as well, don't I you? So that, that is a drink you will like. Mm. I'm just gonna bite 
off camera the Shah Sui pork bun. It's nice. Yeah, it's really nice. It's sweet. You were right with saying it has a sweet mm. sort of taste, but. Malibu. You know what you mean about Malibu? Yeah, yeah. it's very coconutty, Malibu y. Mm. Yeah, yeah, that's strong. I wish it was like more violet, you know, like the pink, the pink violet lemonade. I wish it was more like lavender y kind of. Yeah. It's nice though, isn't it? Yeah, that is strange because I'm not getting any vodka. Yeah. Yeah, that's weird. We have just finished that, it was absolutely delicious. Can I just say how aesthetically and beautifully pleasing China Pavilion is? It's so beautiful. I'm trying to look because the Festival of the Arts, they usually do like paintings or like nice little things on like the, the, the architect places. And I'm trying to find where they are, but I've not seen one yet. Maybe because we've not been looking and I've only just realized that they do it for this festival, but I'm trying to find like where they are. So this is the art that I was talking about. So this isn't normally here. It's only on when the Festival of the Arts is. So I'm going to keep going around and trying to find all the different arts. But how cute is that? Germany Pavilion there is singing going on she's really really good she's actually behind Hi. this basically and we've just got the beef short rib which looks absolutely amazing we tried this last time didn't we and we really liked it yeah but it's one of them that we're just we're just having it again yeah so really delicious how much was it 875 I think that's worth it yeah more worth it than the beef Wellington yeah oh definitely yeah, yeah. yeah definitely. and then we've got this to look out of so beautiful but yeah, we really enjoyed it, but let's try it again. All right, that is literally... Oh, not, not put any effort into that. That falls apart, that's I mean, perfect. Fork. Whoa, yeah, that so is cool, got, yeah. You don't even need a knife. That already looks delish, so... I have to say, I've not even tried it, but I'd highly recommend it. All right, it's good. We did like it before. Definitely worth it. This over the Beef Wellington. Yeah, oh, definitely. Okay, so we have Oh, she's straight in. Then we give me a chance to get the intro sorted, okay. So basically what she's bought though is a rainbow kakagori. Yeah, it's my favourite. Which is seven dollars and she loves it. She loves uh, it that much she couldn't wait for me to talk about it before she had a bite. I love Disney dogs. Um so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take a break from the festival yeah. bits. We have a pause. And we're gonna walk. For anyone who doesn't know, over to the back of World Showcase Lagoon, which is somewhere over here, somewhere. Walk down there, and you can exit towards the skyline, and we're going to head to the beach club yeah, to just have a relax. I want to just find the lounge fly bag, I'm going to yeah. show you what I want. And she wants to compare. Um, and I'm going to have to decide. I can't mm. even upload this and decide which one. Yeah. In fact, I might ask on my Instagram. So yeah. One of you might have picked my lounge fly bag. Yeah, could be a vote. We'll see. Oh. Oops. Very messy, but very good. It, it's not like hot, hot today, so it's actually really good to have it's, it because it's not yeah, melting. It's 24 degrees. So we've now just arrived at the boardwalk, and oh my gosh, the sun is beaming. It is so hot right now and so beautiful. I picked the perfect timing, didn't I, to have one of these? Nearly finished it, really nice. Highly recommend, by the way. It is so quiet, so blissful here. I just love it. Do you want your shades? Yeah, I think we need it. I'm getting all excited that we're having our, our sunglasses on in January. But we're gonna go into the beach club now, but I'm just admiring this for a minute or two. Thank you. So 
one's got. Let's go back out. Okay, let's swing. Come on, in tandem. We're not in tandem with one another. Back. Forward. Back. Forward. Fuck yeah. <laughs> All right, so we've just come from the boardwalk shop because I was trying to find the lounge fly bag. But of course I had to get my famous strawberries. I'm so glad that they still do this. I was like kind of worried in case they stopped them for whatever reason. So I'm excited for that. And then Scott's got a chocolate caramel cheesecake. Which looks very nice. And then we've refilled our mug here. What did you get, Coca-Cola? Yeah. Yeah. And yeah, we're just gonna have a nice Chill. Yeah, relax. I love coming here and I love just chilling around this bit here. It's just so like quiet and calm. It's really, really lovely if you just want to just relax away from all the hustle and bustle in the parks and stuff. I love these nice quiet areas. Do you want to know the prices? Oh yeah, go on. My strawberries are like $3.99, aren't they? Yeah, the strawberries are $3.99. This was $5.79. Looks really nice. Yeah, we can share it. Bon appétit. Bon appetito. Yeah, it looks really good to be fair. You try some. That's your style. I'm going to feed spoon feed you. Oh, go ahead. Oh, go ahead. Mm. It's giving Cheesecake Factory. Mm. 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 Oh my god, that's really nice. How much was that? Hard cover. That's really nice. Alright, so like I always say, I always rave about these strawberries here. They're just so juicy and nice. A lot of you said about the strawberry festivals, and I definitely need to... We need to go to one, don't we, Scott? Because I'm, like, obsessed. Yeah, definitely. There's, there's, there's all... Well, they do all kinds. There's He's actually looking for when the dates are for strawberry festivals. End of February through to middle of March. And so it's like springtime. Some in spring, April time. And yeah, we definitely need to go. We normally do come here in the spring, but... Oh, I just love them. You need to get them if you love strawberries. So we're in the beach club shop and I found the bag that I really love. It's scented like ice cream. Um, it does actually smell like it when you really smell it. It has the beach club resort on. I'm not sure what price it is because the price has been ripped off, which always tells me it's going to be a lot more. Yeah. But the scented ears to go with it. I really genuinely love this one, but I am contemplating the other one as well. But I feel like I want to go for that one more. But I'm going to show you the other one and then I'm going to do a poll on my Instagram. So hopefully you've decided for me. But how pretty are they? Oh, I think I just heard. They are $88, this one. Yeah, so I think the other one's like 65 or something. I'll have to have a look. I do love that one though, it is a bit of me, and plus, I'm not really gonna wear what I'm gonna wear today again, but doesn't it match? Like, how cute is that? I'm gonna go and we'll show you the other one, which one I like as well. Just before we leave, Scott is refilling our mug. So handy to bring out, because when you like visit some of the resorts, so good. Which one did you get today? Coca-Cola? Yeah. Why did you look at me like that? Did you want drink any of us? I will. Well, you'd, you'd have I had a Fanta. Sprite. Fanta, I had a Fanta. Sprite. I'll be honest, I had a bit of Coca-Cola left in there as well, so oh. save me washing it out. Fair enough. Going back into Epcot, and look who we've just seen. So cute. <laughs> Giving away pictures with Tigger. Oh. Or two, or two. Love that. All right, so we have just seen Tigger. Then we just saw Mary Poppins penguins. Then there was Mr. Smee. It was like a really magical character meeting. It took like literally was not even a line for a minute. It was so quick. I just loved that experience. 
Scott has just gone to the toilet and then we are gonna go into creations and then I'm gonna like see which lounge fly bag I want and then after that I don't know we're just gonna relax still um the wait times are really long still so we're just taking it by ear definitely all right so we've just gone to Golmey landscapes and we are about to get the wild mushroom risotto $9.75 all right so this is the wild mushroom risotto i did have it last year and it was really really nice so we're gonna try it again looky here we got some friends lots of friends my ab waiting for food speaking of food mm. it's really nice you like it they just shaved this though it was nice when it was like a bit more of a block of cheese no. all right we watched a vlog recently and they said that. I had to look back on it and see the cheese. Mm. And yeah, she's right. Yeah. It's better with a block of cheese and shave, but it's still with it. Yeah. Mm. It's Scott's turn. He doesn't like mushrooms, but I'm literally... Oh my God, are you actually going to eat the mushroom? What? What do you think? <laughs> it's not my most favourite thing. No, but... It's all right. Because I, I love risotto. I love chicken and mushroom risotto so much. It doesn't have any chicken in by the way, but I just genuinely love it. Oh my gosh, what's he doing? Just trying to get through there. Hmm? Trying to get through his Oh! <laughs> oh, so I'm looking at my messages and look at that. So obviously I'm uploading onto Instagram. We was at the boardwalk before and I obviously took a picture. It's not even loading, I can't look. This is the picture I took and posted. So cute. My strawberries and then obviously a bestie has said. That's just been my day. <laughs> Not sure if I've already shown it already, but this is the the other bag. One seventy eight. Right, so the Beach Club ones. What was it like? Eighty eight. Eighty eight, and this one's seventy eight. I wonder if the other one's seventy eight. Maybe the other one's seventy eight, but they've ripped the price off because, like, I don't know, it swells and I don't know. This one is a nice one. It, it genuinely is like a nice magical part one. So far, this one on the pole is winning, so we'll just have to see. So looking at this one, Scott just mentioned this one's actually 88. And like you Does it said, have the price on it? Why, yes. why does the Beach Club one have not have the price? Well, that, hang on a minute, that's 98. Oh. This one's 88. Gosh. Yeah, the Beach Club one, like the prices here are ripped off. I don't really know why. This is 88. That one's a nice sparkly one as well. That one's just magical. That just screams magic. Oh, that's mine. 98. Yeah, that's how much I paid for mine. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> And then we just got a plain black one. Yeah, it is a new one. Alright, so we're just queuing up in a five minute wait for... There we go. <laughs> and once you step on the moving platform, the platform is moving at the same speed. Keep the legs inside the wheel, and please watch your show. During your slow moving journey, during your slow moving journey, your time machine will slowly rotate back. room for a little freshen up and now we're leaving again and these are other lights so pretty we're gonna keep them on hi <laughs> we are relaxing just for a little bit at the resort plans for tonight is magic kingdom magic kingdom because that's what scott wanted to do i just said it's an epcot scott day he decides everything that we're going to be doing and he wants to go back to magic kingdom tonight so that's what we're going to do I um, got this from last vlog, last night basically. It is the Valentine's cake block, isn't it? Isn't it? Is it um, chocolate? So I'm gonna try that. No idea. I think it is. It looks like chocolate. But I think are these marshmallows? 
Mm, yes. I don't know. This is so good. <laughs> oh my god. Mm, chocolate. Not much. I think we're gonna go Pecos Bill. I don't know how much I'm gonna film because I feel like we filmed a lot today, but I also, when I was doing a poll, I was asking how many, how long people want to watch. And a lot of you said like an hour, like a lot of you said an hour. So we're just casually filming. I'm not trying to like do as much, but I also want to have it as a casual pace. Do you know what I mean? We're on holiday, so obviously you're coming with us. So I want to film as much as I possibly can. We've also just got a hot chocolate. So yeah, we're just gonna chill here for a bit and then get the bus to Magic Kingdom. Yeah. But it's perfect weather. I've just refreshed up and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. Just admiring and chilling. The world, admiring the world. Admiring the world. And we are here back at the Magic Kingdom. Looks a little bit more less crowded tonight, I'm gonna say. Don't. I'm not gonna jinx Speak. it, I don't claim jinx jinxing it. it, but a lot less crowded indeed. Uh, and there we are, the fabulous, amazing, magical castle shot. Walking right down Main Street. We're gonna make our way to Cosmic Rays. No, we're not. No? Echoes Bill. We're gonna make our way to Pecos Bill, have some food, and then just see where the night takes us. So tonight the parks close at 10. All right, yeah. So again, the time is half past six now. So we were on schedule for the time I wanted to kind of be here. So yeah, let's make our way to um, Pecos Bill. Does it, Scott's, Scott's laughing at me because I keep saying different places, but I mean Pecos Bill. The wonders take. <laughs> oh yeah, we are definitely going to be watching it. I don't think tonight, but there will be a night, and we will be watching it. All right, so we are now in Pecos Bill. Wow, I have got the free beef tacos. Scott's got a double cheeseburger with bacon. We've got some tortilla chips with some queso. Wow, and then we. So for the bur for the bur double burger with the chips and queso, yeah. that was sixteen fifty. All right, okay. For this taco trio that was ten ninety nine. Right. Honestly, this is one of my favourites. I love this place. We have just finished our food, which was really lovely. I think that is it for food today. We've uh, we well and truly ate so much food today. Oh, I'm just looking up in the moon. One second. Also, look at the look at the look at there the Liberty is. Bowl. And the Liberty Tree Bowl, yeah. It's, ch it's chocolate bowl. Oh, is it? So we are now heading to uh, Big Thunder Mountain. It is a 40-minute wait, so we're gonna see if it actually is 40 minutes. It actually really looks more longer than a 40 minute though. Like they're queuing outside. I feel like that's gonna I'm be the a lot. Yeah. in a bit. Let's reassess this one. Yeah. We're going to make our way to Pirates, which is a 30 minute wait. 35. Oh, 35. Also, we, Scott was just saying just then, the last two days have actually been really busy. We just met a bestie, Poppy, and uh, we were talking to her and she said she have been here for the past two weeks and she was like, this has probably been like one of the most busiest Januaries, which is crazy. Because in the past, honestly, it's Obviously, Disney's always going to be busy, but... She said the rest of the holiday has been dead. Then all of a sudden, the past two days... It's like, been... yeah, gone crazy. So, yeah, hopefully it calms down a little bit, but Disney is Disney. We just enjoy ourselves no matter what. <laughs> all right, so this is saying it's 35. All right, that's a bit mental. That is definitely I, not 35. Uh, I call baloney on that. What is going on What tonight? is going on? I'm gonna have to take them times with a pinch of salt. We're gonna have to just look at them with our own eyes. Yeah, let me just 
like keep this clear though we're not complaining in the slightest i'm literally just showing you we are obviously we're very lucky to like be here and stuff please we, don't think we're complaining we're just showing you and we're just trying to yeah what we're trying to do is tactically plan our time because <laughs> yeah. we're only here for seven days yeah so just make we, things we, easier if we if we know we can ride that ride at a different time yeah then and we it'll be will. shorter then we would we'd rather just ride yeah. it after we are just walk in and can we just see the crowds here this is the crowd this is literally the line that's a lightning lane line a lightning lane line for the haunted mansion the regular line's there oh my goodness can you see this line well the lightning lane's going down to near the bloody bowl that is actually crazy that is not 45 minute way no it says it's a 45 minute that's well over an hour wow all right so out of every single line that we thought like was like nope nope this one's the most at 50 minutes 55 55 minutes but i think it's me less because we we have queued i'm telling you now you'll see when we stop walking we have queued in longer queues for this ride and got in in less than 55 minutes i think 40 minutes wow possibly even 35. i think he's calling it a bit too naive there but we'll see yep well we'll, we'll see. see we'll see when the line stops we have waited <laughs> in longer queues for seven dwarves okay. and got in in less time all right so we'll see have we lost our minds I, I think we have i might say no, 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 there's, a, no there's, a, there's, a, there's a difference waiting 45 50 minutes of pirates of the caribbean and waiting 40 minutes for seven dwarves yeah because seven dwarves is seven more dwarves like is usually like an hour and a yeah. half wait i get that i get that so if, we, right. do, if we do this in 40 minutes that's like bonus. Okay, let's see then. Oh, look, I think this queue stopped this here. Stopped. We've waited in longer queues before. We've waited in seven doors at the thing down there. Yeah, okay. Right, time that's going on. Let's see. The time is 20 minutes past seven, by the way. Is the fireworks on at eight or nine tonight? We'll have to check. So yeah. Because I feel like, Scott said it before, the fireworks, like it's the madness before the fireworks. And then when the fireworks happen, it like seems to calm down a bit. Well, it's like it's mental. It's not mental, but it's just busier than what we have been used to in January. Yeah. 40 minutes, 45. Um... I was out by 45 seconds. I'll take that. <laughs> about to ride. You said we wouldn't do it. You were saying 55, 55. <laughs> I am the king. <laughs> You didn't believe my last get my last guess and that coming, so right, we're gonna have to put the camera away, but yeah. Heartbound with neck problems, motion sickness, or other conditions that could be aggravated by this adventure. Might I be ten? Okay, that is really surprising. Like we've walked all the way here, not even stopped once. It's basically a walk-on. It's basically a walk-on. Alright. That's not even 20. That's, that's a walk This is so chill. Cool. Alright, let's ride! Yeah. Yeah, you, you, you looked at me funny when I said 10. Let me 
Go oh, left hand. Okay, so as you can see, we are back see, now. We are back. So what happened was we was meant to get on Space, Space Mountain, Mountain, as you saw. And then And it we, all was going well. And then just before we got on, literally just before, it managed it just broke down. Yep. All the lights, light, came lights on. on, bang, everything That's stopped. It. So luckily, which was really lovely, we ended up getting a free lightning lane, yeah. which we used on a big Thunder Mountain. We yeah. kind, of, kind of left a walk on, kind of, weren't it? Uh, we didn't wait that long. Five minutes? Yeah, yeah five minutes. Something yeah. like that. Yeah. Um, which I didn't film because everything just happened at a quick pace. It was so busy because the fireworks. It was a very quick pace, finished. yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, we're back now. I am honestly... She's not in a good way. So tired. So tired. So full. Feeling sick. I feel sick after Big yeah. Thunder Mountain. I feel like that ride just did me. Wiped you out, didn't it? Yeah, it well, you definitely wiped me wiped out. Wiped you out. Definitely. So, water in this. And we're heading back now. Shower, bed. That's me for the night. Finito. We have on the next vlog Animal Kingdom. Mm -hmm. Which we'll show you that. Um, so, yeah. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And we'll see you on the next one. I'm gonna leave you with what we've just seen from the cast members, which is so <laughs> cool. So good night besties. I hope you enjoyed this video. Plenty more to come. I hope you enjoyed the day with us. And yeah, we'll see you next time. I appreciate you. Thank you so much for watching. Peace. <laughs> Peace.